is Casper Nice. I'm a chemical engineer and I specialize in managing major projects. In 2011, SAPI asked me to be the project director for a major project that they wanted in uh, Mpumalanga. As we prayed about it, I asked him, what do I have to go and do in Nelspreet? And he very clearly gave both of us a message that there are relationship problems in Nelspreet. I said, but what's that got to do with projects? I said, I'll, I'll show you when, you when you get there. I arrived at the mill and the mill is situated in an area that's surrounded by uh, informal settlements. And there's a big animosity between the, the people living there and the, actual, and the actual factory. And we knew we didn't have enough place for everybody to stay, so we had to try and use the local community in some way in, 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 in helping on this project. And I said, God, what do I do? And he says, train the people. So I spoke to the SAPI management and they agreed to the idea of us actually training the local community up, semi-skill them, so they could work in the project. We interviewed about 2,000 people. Now on a project like this, you, you have different phases. You have a civil, civil and a civil engineering and a civil construction phase and a mechanical engineering and a mechanical construction phase. So we decided to train them in that, in that sequence as well. They would come for six weeks on their own cost, on their own transport, no salary, and we would put them through training and when they finished, they get a SAKWA certificate that they are now a trained uh, person. Every day they would start with uh, prayer and then they would sing the anthem. And that alone had, had such an effect on the people that we, uh, a lot of them gave their hearts to the Lord during the, during the project. Uh, we trained 650 people and 475 of them found jobs on the project. And in fact, that 475 had made enough money to look after 2,400 people in that community. At the same time when we were doing this project, two other major projects was happening in the region. And both of them suffered for six months at least where they had no work because of people and industrial action and, and people not wanting to work. And we didn't have one bit of industrial action. The community actually formed a, like a, a cloud of protection around the mill and, and prevented anybody from coming in. That's, that's what the law did <laughs> with all these people. And the project was nominated for, internet, for a national award. We won a gold award for training and for interacting with the community. And this whole program is now being taken countrywide. And that's being put as an example of how to get the community involved on, on projects. It was just an honor to be, to be part of it and to be used by God in such a way. To see the change in the people from in that six weeks where they arrive there and they've got absolutely nothing and after six weeks they've got this certificate and they trained and they, they can now go out and they can find a job. And that change in their life was just incredible.